Hi, I'm Stephen the Pet Man from Big Apple Pet Supply. I'm going to show you all about our Big Apple acrylic sump tanks. Now, a lot of people have questions about sump tanks in this situation as far as how do I set them up, uh, what, what type of materials should I use. Well, we build a lot of our sump tanks out of acrylic. Now, we make them out of glass as well. But the problem with glass is A, if we ship it to you, we have to ship it on truck line and that's very expensive. With the acrylic sumps, we can ship them right to you, UPS ground, right to your door. It's very affordable. The other thing I like about acrylic, it's very light. You can just lift up acrylic very easily. This is a 50 gallon, uh, 36, 18, 17 inch, a very popular, popular acrylic sump size for us. Um, again, try doing that with a glass uh, sump. You can't. It weighs like three times the amount. So a couple of things about acrylic that's really neat. A, what we just went over, it's light. B, there's a lot of clarity to it, so you can really see what's going on inside of your sump. Um, there's rounded edges on the front. It's basically seamless. Um, you're not going to, you know, as far as the potential for leaks or anything like that, in acrylic, sumps just don't leak in acrylic. Uh, that's another great thing. There's, there's, the seams are not like what you have to do in a glass tank. So, basically, um, how, does this, how does a sump like this work? Well, we can do it a number of ways. This is our stock model, which if you buy off our website, this is exactly how it's going to come. Uh, the spacers here are about an inch and a half. Uh, you can see the basic flow would be this. You would have your pump here going back up to your enclosure, your, your uh, basic uh, plumbing going down out of your glass tank would be here. And what's interesting is we put in these, um, these pieces, which are, are almost like milk carton crates, and they sit on top of uh, a piece that, that holds them a few inches above the bottom. So you would put your media, like your foam media, whatever you wanted to filter out a lot of the more dense um, dirt or grit or whatever it is that's coming out of your tank into here, and it would all collect on top of the foam. It would then go under, up, over, through here, and then in the center, a lot of people would either do live sand, they would do bio balls, that would be your second uh, stage of filtration. It would then, the water would flow up, over, under, come out through here, and back up to your tank. That's really how a sump works. And if you're going to do salt water, if you're going to do um, any kind of uh, tank that has uh, anemones or, or uh, anything like that, a reef tank basically, you're going to want a sump for a reef tank. So that's the way to go. If you're doing salt water, I love having a sump because it adds that much more water to your enclosure. So let's say you have 100 gallon up top and you have 50 gallons in your sump. You really now have 150 gallons flowing through your system. So you really added a lot of water. Um, so my choice for salt or reef is a sump, but basically you could go with the canister filter in the salt water if you wanted to. So that is the great thing about um, acrylic. The last thing I want to mention is acrylic is about 20% better insulation than glass. So you're going to find that keeping temperatures in your sump, uh, a lot of people will actually put their the heaters in their sump. When you have a sump, instead of putting the heaters in the you can see it. It's just nicer. You also can add all your chemicals, um, any kind of medications in your sump rather than adding to your fish tank. So again, I really like using a sump. Um, we basically have a, quite a number of stock sizes on our website at BigApplePetSupply.com. We also will make custom ones. So if you want to vary the sizes inside, the locations, we can do all that. We can make modifications and we'll be happy to do custom work for you. Um, again, uh, this is the Big Apple Acrylic Sump. I'm Stephen the Pet Man and I thank you for watching.